Well, since I haven't been outside the house properly since about m March the 10th, I thought I'll go for a drive today because I thought the roads will be empty. God, I got that wrong. First of all, I got stuck behind a bus and then I got stuck behind a little old lady doing two miles an hour. And then when I got to Dungeness, I thought I'll go for a nice walk and it lashed down. It hasn't rained for how long? And as soon as I go for a walk, the heavens open. Somebody up there has got it in for me. Never mind, I got uh, fish and chips and a big bag of kippers. So I'm going home now and I'm going to have kippers with samphire and a bit of lemon juice. There you go. I hope you're having a nice day. Look after yourselves. Ta-ra. Well, I was supposed to go to a, let's call it, a little gathering tonight. But as you can see, the engine's overheating. I'll have to get the bus. Pissed off. <laughs> Hello everyone, um, I haven't been on Instagram for a while because I've been busy, really busy finishing off this kids book, I've been putting a lot of hours in, it's out in September, but I just want to introduce you to my new chicken, say hello Morgana, no, you're not speaking now, mm, got the ump have you, hey, eh? she's quite, quite feisty this one, she's only young and I've only just got her, aren't you pretty girl aren't you, <laughs> anyway, I hope you're all well and looking after yourselves. And um, yes, I'm talking. Do you mind? And uh, I'll speak to you soon. Yeah, hey, what do you reckon? You got that evil look in your eye again. They'll be going for me. Oof. Morning, everyone. I've just woke up to this. I'm pissed off. Paul O'Glady, the beloved TV presenter and comedian who broke onto the scene with his drug act persona, Lily Savage, has died at age of 67. His R. Andre Potasio confirmed in a statement that O'Glady died unexpectedly but peacefully on Tuesday evening. We ask at this difficult time that you celebrate his life. You also respect our privacy as we come to terms with this loss. But as she said in a statement, he will be greatly missed by his beloved ones, friends, family, animals, and all those who enjoyed his humor, wit, and compassion. I know that he would want me to thank you for all the love you have shown him over the years. Days ago, Oglady had finished a stint playing Miss Hannigan in the musical Annie and was set to resume the role in performances around the UK and Ireland later this year. Tributes poured in early on Wednesday such sad news. TV presenter Dolane Kelly wrote on Twitter, Paul Oglady, funny, fearless, brave, kind and wise. I always think dogs are the best judge of character and they adored him. Thank you so much for watching.